my blessings it's miss may back with another video and this is all about your classroom management and your classroom environment you guys know i speak highly on having a well running classroom along with developing positive relationships with your students that is so important to have a positive loving caring environment that is full with empathy love laughter and kindness so this is something I do with my firsties probably on the third or fourth day of school. It just kind of depends on our flow. So I'm going to model for you what it looks like when my students transition from morning tubs, fun tubs, I call them fun tubs, in the morning after they do their unpacking, what they do when they clean up and find their, um, actually they clean up and they find a spot in the circle so we can begin morning meeting. So I'm just going to model that for you so you know what that looks like and you can kind of get a feel for how I start developing those positive relationships and a classroom environment that is very caring, loving, you know, just shows a lot of empathy. So stay tuned. Boys and girls, so I am going to teach you a new song today and it is super duper cool super duper cute and super duper fun like miss may loves it and this song is going to be playing in our classroom for one particular reason but before i tell you that reason we're going to watch the video and then we're going to talk about why this video is so important for our classroom this school year so then I show the video. The video is Good Morning. The song is so, so cute. I mean, once you get the vibe of it and it becomes catchy to you instantly, it's just, you know, good morning to you. It's so nice to see you. It's fun greeting you. Here we are. Okay, let me stop. Go watch the video. Link in the description box below but it's super cute and so after i show that video to my firsties i explain to them or i talk to them and i ask them why do you think this song is so important for our classroom and some may get it some may not but i go into telling them the the importance of that song and that song is so important because we are going to be greeting each other every single morning to this song after we clean up from our fun tubs so then I explain that to them and then I just kind of um, also let them know that it's important that we greet each other every single morning and I tell them this song is going to play two times. After the second time when it's done, everybody should be in a circle for morning meeting time. And then let's see what else. So then I, um, I explained to them also that no one should be left out. If you see someone that doesn't have someone to greet, you call them over to you and your partner or you and your partner go to that person. Because sometimes we have odd numbers in our classroom and I think it's just important that they learn to make sure they look out for each other. And I teach that right out the gate. Nobody should be left alone. And if someone is left in, left alone, then when I talk to them during um, morning meeting time, we kind of discuss what I noticed and what made me sad. And um, hopefully we can make a difference the next day. But usually, you know, the kids see somebody and they'll, you know, they'll call them over and say, come over or they'll go to them so that nobody ever feels left out. I also let them know that everybody has to greet. There's no, you just go, when you're done cleaning up your fun tubs, you just go and sit in the circle to be ready for morning meeting. Everybody greets. Nobody can sit during this time. This is a, I have to do type of situation because that's how we develop friendships and relationships in the classroom. And I also encourage them to choose someone different every day um, to be greeting with so it's it's really cute it's really fun the kids do enjoy it and it just develops it just produces that positive learning environment in the classroom so after we talk about why that song is important and why we play that song we um i model for them so i explain to them what it looks like so i'll choose another student and that student and i we will um we will I'll show them and you know and I just start dancing and smiling at my partner and then when it says shake hands we make sure we're shaking hands when we wave we make sure we're waving at each other and smiling um, when we give hugs we give them a hug I just make sure I model what I want that to look like 
when we're when we're doing that song they're free to sing along with the song if they want to because once they get used to it and comfortable with it they do start singing with it and that's perfectly fine with me the goal is to produce a happy loving classroom environment where we all care for one another and we all look out for each other that's how i start developing those relationships so i just wanted to introduce to you another transition song and it is goodbye or good morning one of my favorite here on youtube as well again link in the description box below and basically i think i mentioned that that song i play that they come in in the morning okay so here's kind of what it looks like they come in in the morning and they unpack their backpacks their you know they put everything where it's supposed to go as i have taught them and then they can choose a fun tub or a morning tub whatever you call them but i call mine fun tubs they can choose a fun tub in the morning and they you know work on that and then usually after the announcements the pledge and all that good stuff I play the song maybe about five minutes after and I play that song and when they hear that song good morning they know they clean up their area really good put everything back they find somebody really quickly that they want to greet that morning that's real simple and I play it two times for them so they after that second time everybody should be in a circle ready for morning meeting or care time whatever you call it so Anyways, guys, thank you so much for stopping by watching this video. I also appreciate you guys um, in the comment section giving your two cents worth, your positivity, your kindness. I just love when you guys share your thoughts and um, what you do. Also appreciate you guys coming over to the to the gram and showing your love to me as well on there it's been pretty fun talking to you guys there seeing your stories you watching my stories if you're not following me on instagram it's one underscore fab underscore teacher and you can find me there so don't forget to always pray because god will truly make a way my blessings i love you so much i love you i love you i love you bye